With Marvel Spider-Man 2 already being out for a month now, and a lot of things happening here and there in between that release, a lot of the community just looking at the various suits and redesigns and kind of thinking of what they should look like. In this video, I want to talk about how Peter's new anti-venom suit should have looked like in Marvel Spider-Man 2, because the suit is great, don't get me wrong. Like. You know, a lot of the new concept arts and things have come out. A lot of the community has posted their redesigns since the game came out. Um, and genuinely, like I said, a lot of things have happened. I mean, I'm even married now, which is freaking amazing. And I'm really happy. <laughs> but this suit is great, right? Like when you look at it, it is cool. But it doesn't 100% feel like what Anti-Venom to me personally should have looked like. Like, first of all, the lenses here that you can see right now, the McFarlane lenses are uh, yeah, they're, they're inspired by the McFarlane like lenses, but they're amazing, right? Like that's probably one of my favorite things about this suit. However, the actual like chest emblem, I'm not 100% sure about because obviously the suit has just gone over the advanced suit and kind of mimicked it, right? But it just doesn't feel right. Like that emblem to me just doesn't feel 100%. Like I like the, you know, symbiote suit emblem and I wish it was just like that, right? And also like the weird like shoulder cutout to me it just doesn't feel right on this suit because you know it could look a little bit better than that like later on in the video you'll see like an actual official concept art of the anti-venom suit and you'll be like okay that does make a lot more sense so you know and then of course like the bit when we go down the suit like at the bottom it's very like barren right like it's really hard to explain it, but you know, looking at it here right now, you can just see how much there's nothing else down there. It's just, it's just completely white, right? I wish it had, it had like more black accents to it or boots or something like that. Because like I said, it just feels completely empty. Like the balance of the suit is just not the best. The back of it is pretty cool. I wish like the front and the back of like uh, the actual elbows was black like that. I feel like that would have been really good. And when I say front and back, I mean like the front of the suit, right? Um, but, you know, I, it is what it is right now, but we're going to look at some actual art done by some wonderful artists in the community that will be linked in the description. And then we're going to look at some concepts and some mods of what this suit should look like. So if you're new to the channel, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. I truly appreciate all the support. And let's look at the arts. So I've shown these before in a different video, but I'm going to go through these really quickly to get to the main thing here. So this is a more accurate to the game redesign of the anti-venom suit. And this one is actually pretty cool itself because the spiders kind of just morph into the like arms and you know, it keeps a lot of the same things, but I love like the shade of blue there. So this one's more of a comic one by uh, Kiwi art, but then we go down here, right? And this one's actually fantastic. I have the artist links in the description, um, like previously as well. And this one actually works a lot better for me personally, because there's a bit more black to the suit. So it's not just like, you know, a complete like bare bone bit down here, right? And I think a lot of you guys can agree. So in the comments below as well, do let me know what your favorite redesign is. And if you're new to the channel and you're watching this, hey, subscribe. We're literally almost at 95,000 subscribers. My goal is to hit 100,000 before the end of the year. So I truly appreciate your support in helping me make my dream come true. But yes, so, you know, there's quite a few different variations of this one with webs that are kind of like not see-through and then this. I think this is really cool, but also at the same time, it is incredibly busy. I think there shouldn't be webs, at least on this part here, um, past the spiders, I think maybe like keep the webs here and then up here but for some certain parts don't have them um but i really do like this concept here the concept here is awesome and then we've also got like this redesign here as well again by kiwi arts i'm gonna show it to you fully and properly here now this one is you know a bit more accurate to the original anti-venom in the comics but my idea more so for this wouldn't be a redesign of the actual original suit but you could totally do something like this for the surge mode because the surge mode is just the same. Now I understand it's like an amplified version for the original symbiote suit where he gets angry and the venom kind of takes over here. But also it could still be like a surge of power that Peter can activate when he gets upset, which makes the suit kind of react to his emotions because he's the one controlling it, right? Instead of the other way around. So it'd be like a cool little play here and you could see, you know, the orange kind of return and this would look incredibly like just sick at night 
um, you know, the spikes here as well are just absolutely wonderful to look at. And you've even got the triangle bits here for like the, I guess, shooting webs or something. I don't even know if he actually shot webs out of that bit in the game. It's kind of strange. But then, you know, you've also got the boots as well. I think it would have just been a sick redesign to have for a surge mode. And then finally, something that I do want to show you here is actual concept art by Dennis Chan over on like art station that shows like a concept art of venom versus spider-man but if you notice this advanced well no this anti-venom suit is quite different right um there's a lot more obviously like damage involved which i'm like you know i feel like we've missed out on that in this game but look at the damage so the lenses are pretty much the same but there's not even that much black on the suit which if you kept it like this i would totally understand the lack of black on the suit itself right and it's I actually prefer this design over the one that we got um, because you know the spider emblem is clear you know you've got a bit of like black going down here down his arms and it just seems like they kind of realized what they were doing with it right like it just looks like an anti-venom suit like a very simple suit that just works really well and this would have just looked amazing right but now to you know carry on with the conversation and the redesign you know we've got this and this is in the Marvel Spider-Man Remastered mod. This is the Agastopia sort of uh, redesign. And this one is also... So the mod is by uh, Reza. But the redesign is by Agastopia. Who has a lot of cool redesigns. And one of my favorite things about this one specifically, right? So we're going to get rid of the orbit part. So check this out. Of, of course, I love the lenses here. The lenses are really fantastic, right? Um, it gives like homage to the actual like anti-venom look itself right um but the actual emblem here is something i really really like because first of all you know obviously the suit is kind of anti-venom so it should kind of keep the look of the symbiote suit itself right instead of you know kind of looking like the ps4 emblem but you know it's fine but i much prefer the way it looks here it flows a lot better i feel like and then of course you know the actual like strip bit goes down all the way so it adds extra sort of um it just looks way better right like it, the the like actual feet uh, slash legs area doesn't look bare bones so it adds a lot to it then you know you've got this bit here as well and it just looks really really good actually and then we go to the back here and even on the back it looks absolutely fantastic right and it's all i really could have asked for out of a redesign if you were going to do it now, the lenses actually love as well, but if they still had the original ones on here, I wouldn't have minded it, like minded it at all. But this is definitely something I really, really like when it comes to redesign. And then, of course, you know, we've got the anti-venom, like, redesign as well. Um, and this is just kind of like a suit style that I wish we had, which is like a black and white version. So it's just inverted, right? Like, it's inverted even more if you look at it. So, like, the black bits are white and the white bits are black. It's just a little cool style. Um... And then of course here you've got the like actual red eyes so they could have also gone for this if they really wanted to but i think they just didn't want to and this whole thing just looks amazing and then of course you know we've got like <laughs> like you know anti uh agent anti-venom as well which i think harry might become at like at a point in the future or something but yeah so these are the redesigns i really wish that we had like if we had suit styles for the anti-venom suit this would have been the ideal um alongside the concept art for me but i do want to hear what you guys think in the comments below do you prefer the original or do you like the redesigns and let me know your thoughts on the entire concept of like you know anti-venom in general do you like that peter has it or do you want it to be given to harry so he could also become like a supporting cast of the spidey pals thank you so much for all the love and support on the channel i appreciate it watch this video on screen here Thank you so much. Have an absolutely wonderful day. Peace.